Hey Jelly Babes, welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna be doing a review of this plate, um, a proper review that is. Um, I have used it in conjunction with the review of this Bee Loves plate. If you've not seen it, I will leave links to this in the description box below. And I will be using this stamper as well as I didn't get a chance to use it properly in the other video. And I'm going to be using these um, black pop sticks. I will leave links to where I got them in the description box below for anyone that wants to get them. I sort of saw them on Sarah R's channel and I just thought, oh, they are awesome, would totally love to use those in my videos. And I'm just going to be using this Hit The Bottle Hello There Beautiful, and she certainly is. <laughs> uh, stamping polish, it's new from Hit The Bottle and I purchased these from Nail Artisan. So I'm just going to be using the same um, polish and the same black pop sticks all the way through Jelly Babes. It's very unlike me, I know, but it'll be totally worth it at the end, trust me. They look stunning. <laughs> so you can see I'm not having any issue with the pickup, with the plate, with the stamper, with the polish. They're all working beautifully together. And I have been so, so dying to swatch this plate as it's just gorgeous and it's got really cute images on it. So what I'm going to do is, I think to get the hollow to shine through, you do need to apply a top coat. I'm applying a gel top coat, which I've cured. And I'm just going to get my light. And for some reason, like it's not showing up on camera how beautiful and holographic it is actually in real life. But like I say, near the end of the video, you'll get to see it in all its hollow glory. <laughs> it will be worth it. Um, so yeah, so yeah, so it is very unlike me with my colour combos. Normally I'm very bright, I don't normally have the same base all the way through as well as the same polish if that makes sense um, but I just really wanted to try the both out um, and I thought this was a, a good opportunity to do so so I really like the fact that you can put the Bee Loves logo on your nails um, as it's obviously it's hearts which well I love hearts um, um, but so it's another sort of cool way to have hearts on your nails as well So yes, there's lots of like real cute images on this plate And I did put sizes of the plate in the um, when I used it in the review of the mat um, Yeah, the review of the Bee Lovers plate mat and I will put the sizes in the description box below as I didn't do it before when I was editing. Sorry Jelly Babes! <laughs> so I think with hindsight it probably would have been better to show off this hollow polish with sort of a more, um, I'm going to totally forget, there is an actual name but it's not coming to me, but you know where it's basically like more of a solid stamping image if that makes sense, so like with this um, is it negative space? Is that the one, the word that, the phrase that I'm after? A lot more of negative space images. Whereas with these, these are great if you want to fill in, but to show off the hollowness, it, it's not really doing it justice. Well, it does at the end, but yeah, you know what I mean. This kind of image, I could have done with showing it off more with this type of image right here, because obviously you get to see more of the hollow polish. So can you see what I mean? Can you see how gorgeous that hollow is, especially over the black as well? It's really highly pigmented, which just looks gorgeous. So I'm gonna, um, obviously I'm gonna swatch off all of these fuller images for you, and I'm gonna review some of the smaller images. I did do some swatches of the smaller images with the Bee Loves Rainbow Matte. Um, but yeah, but I think, how many is there? There is like 21 of those like smaller individual images and um, so I'll do as many as possible but I won't be doing them all as that's quite a lot of small individual images and basically um, I'll put like a couple on one pop stick if that makes sense so you'll get to see some of them but you won't be getting to see all of them but you'll get the idea anyway. So it will be summer anytime soon here in the UK, well in the UK anyway, and um, I'm really looking forward to the summer, hopefully we'll have a decent one, we haven't had very great summers here in the past couple of years in the UK, we did have sort of a nice 
sort of spell of weather sort of near the end of May um, and it was it was like 30 degrees um, which is like a well hot here we almost can't cope with it it's almost like it's too hot like complaining that we never see the sun then when the sun comes out it's like I can't cope <laughs> but it was really nice to um, to sort of see and feel the sun um, so yeah so has anybody got any sort of plans for the summer um, you're going anywhere cool or going on some real nice um, holidays just let me know in the comments box below we haven't really got anything much planned we are hoping to go on a much needed vacation sort of near the end of the year yeah jelly mama mr jelly vicious and jelly T junior and jelly teenager are in definite need of a vacation so i was granted with some beautiful sunshine here and it really shows off this hollow gorgeously i really hope it's been picked up on camera i do show some pictures at the end as well where it just sort of captures that gorgeous hollow hollowness i'm sort of doing it slightly out of focus so you can see it see i told you jelly babes they would all look absolutely gorgeous at the end <laughs> so here are the sort of pictures of them showing off obviously the gorgeous perfectly stamped images and that gorgeous hollow which goes really well with the sort of the unicorn theme so i really hope that you've enjoyed this review jelly babes thank you so much for checking it out thank you Bee loves plates for sending me these products i have loved reviewing them and i'll see you in the next one jelly babes bye <laughs>